but you see a lot of guys out and a lot of women out and they've, they're just slogging away in a big gear. A lot of this is about getting in the right cadence and you know making sure that you're putting the right amount of pressure on the pedals. You know, there's no point just rolling around in like, you know, a 60 or 50 RPM cadence all day. You know, you, if you want to improve, you've got to be able to pedal. And once you learn to pedal, then you can push. If your range is between 80 and 100, you're perfect. You know, but you probably want to go a little bit higher than 80. But yeah, I think that's just it. So you're on top of the gear. And um, that's probably one of the big key areas that I see where people make big mistakes, you know. And you see them in the gyms even, when they're on their watt bikes, you know, they're just grinding away on on this or whether they're on their elite turbo or whatever it is, they're grinding a big gear. And you know, to me, that's a, that's a wrong way to go about things. Make sure you're indicating the potholes for the riders behind you. When you're on your own, that's not a problem, you know. But when you're in a group, respect the fact that you've got people in there and if there's a pothole and you swerve and miss it and the guy too back goes down into it and cause a massive crash, there could be three BMO, three behind him coming over the top. So all them little things, you know, point out the dangers you need to make uh, your fellow riders aware of. <laughs>